Okay, here is the part 3 for Initialize with a first time configuration wizard summary. Okay, so wait for the first time configuration wizard summary finish for the final line configuration. So after that, the checkpoint failure will be uh, automatically reboot. On also we can manual to uh, reboot it. So let's see it together when the final line configuration uh, finish. Okay, so you can see the first time configuration wizard alert. You must restart the system in order to finish uh, the configuration. We can tap okay to restart now. Or you can wait for the automatically uh, reboot. So now I manual by click OK to reboot. So please wait while the system may rebooting so it may be uh, need around 5 to 10 minutes for the first configuration okay so now it around 5 minutes ago So we can uh, refresh the page, the web page, to see uh, if the checkpoint already uh, start up. Okay, now still not yet uh, start up. So maybe we need around two or three minutes more. Okay, let's check the our checkpoint is starting the system, so we need to wait. Okay, now the checkpoint is already start up the ways, and we can log into the uh, <coughs> checkpoint via web GUI again. And in this video, we also show you how to configure start the route and default route to the internet by uh, using web GUI. Okay, so you will see this for the first time on overview. overview you can see the Checkpoint security, gateway version, system app, and IP interface. So now we go to the network interface and check the IP that we have uh, configured for the first time is correct or not. Then you can see the Ethernet, uh, Ether 0 and Ether 1, such as uh, Ether 1 in the uh, internal land and for the Ether 0 is internal. So now let's start to configure gateway for the ethanol. So you will be uh, access can be as a internet from the checkpoint to internet first. So by default, if we configure and uh, automatically uh, have a default gateway by uh, management interface. So we will edit this to the Eternal one. So our eternal gateway is 10.20.30.200 and fifty-four. Okay. So now we can start to test ping to the cloud one one for the testing uh, connectivity with the internet. Okay, so now we can reach to the cloud one. Okay, so that's all my video for part 3 so you can wait for the next video for another configure uh, policy and not for the internal to the internet thank you